Hello. Hello. I'm here with Bastian. Am I saying that right? Bastian. Bastian, exactly. And I have made way too many videos about guitars. And to be honest, I really don't want to make any more videos about guitars. But A, I like your guitars and you. So I got Thanks it. And not. also, I saw you have a coffee maker. <laughs> yep, that's the best argument for people to stop by. So, <laughs> how much do you want a video? Uh, how about two coffees for you? And we have a deal, <laughs> Bastian! So, you start on that, I start over here. Okay. So this is something from Zeal that we've seen a few times. I'm going to ask Bastian, is that the same one we've seen a couple of times or are you continuously doing that kind of design? I'm continuously doing this because um, many people are asking for it. And it's just such an awesome show guitar because people are attracted to it and you know, it's just a reason for people to, to stop by and to, to pet it and ask how is it done and um, yeah it's just a nice I, abs I absolutely love it because that is it's actual fabric underneath which is what um, what Ibanez did with the, with the uh, early gems with the floral pattern gems um, so let's turn this around we're not going to talk about what pickups are in there wait a second what pickups are in there in this case Häusel pickups Häusel because Harry rules that's just a rule that Harry rules we have a beautiful guitar tit we have what the crap is that Clusen, oh, Clusen locking tuners, that's nice. Look at, wait, no, no, that's, that's, a, that's a shadow, right? Is that a shadow or is it in the wood? No, it must be shadow. You sure? Wait. Yes, it is a shadow. <laughs> um, look at the cool, um, torxy screws. That's kind of nice. I mean, I think everyone should do that because Philips is just so not modern. Yep. No, it makes sense because we use uh, M6 um, stainless steel screws uh, and these aren't uh, ordinary, ordinary wood screws, so they won't wear out and it's just perfect and connection. In, nowadays, why use a Phillips head? Which just, I mean, that's just, you know, I mean, uh, that, my, that was my sentence. So, um, hey, give, give me a price on this. This one goes for uh, 3800 Roughly. Same idea? just differently beautiful and see Robin if you can catch how deep that lacquer is on top of it and really how what the depth of that of that top looks like that is absolutely beautiful we have of course a stunning flame maple fretboard and it looks like a bone nut and blah 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 and specs and it's all no one really cares about specs and if you want specs please go to Zeal Guitars something dot cn <laughs> uh, Nick Huber made that joke. Uh, Seal Guitars, what? How do I find you? Seal-Guitars.com Seal-Guitars.com Seal I'll put that uh, underneath somewhere because for specs, just go there because we, we can rattle down length of necks and stuff but I mean, that's all boring, right? Who cares about that anyways? Yeah, I'm here for the coffee, come on. <laughs> um, here we have an interesting amalgam of styles. We have technically something tea-ish but off SETI with three singlies and a shala something and an angled five way and look at the little wooden truss rod cover there this is definitely also with the pickguard being round five point neck thing oh and a recessed um, cavity cover on the tremolo which you see very very rarely Usually tremolo covers are on top. Nice job there. Um, what's the model called and what do I have to fork over for this beautiful monstrosity in blue? <laughs> this one is the blue bird, of course. Right of course. It, we have the raw bird, so it's basically the bird. And um, the idea was to uh, create a um, kind of symbiosis model between, you know, um, uh, a Jazzmaster or a, a Telecaster and um, a Strat. And basically mix it all together and that was the approach to create something that works with the with the Strat um, specification, with the Tele specification and next will be some kind of Jaguar-ish uh, specification and this will all work on this one shape. There are beautiful variations of something we know with your own own twist on it. Price point, go! This one goes for uh, 31, this one goes for 2900. Totally fine for handmade guitars. And um, here, of course, is the one that Sven Holemann has one of. Exactly. Yeah. Just his one is not quite as pretty. No, it is. Um, but I, I love the white with the white, ultra simple, 
um, uh, those hollow or you know this ring dots. Um, this is just gorgeous. So um, see what we have. We have a beautiful shaping up here. Look at that on the headstock. That is nicely done. Recessed uh, the tuning peggy things, which are not locking. That makes me sad because it was so perfect. Because every guitar should have locking tuners, period. But I really like the sexiness of the roundness of the, of course, what Robin isn't showing right now <laughs> up here. Those are really, re really sexy. Yeah, but I'm, now I'm talking about them. <laughs> um, no, beautiful lines on this guitar. It actually, um, I always say no one is doing the super ergonomic shaping of the Joe Satriani by Albanese, which is one of the most ergonomic guitars in the world. And this is exactly going in that direction. Everything rounded off. Hold the mic, point that in my face. Everything rounded off. It definitely reminds me of the Albanese Joe Satriani. One of the nicest guitars to play because everything is just smooth kind of melts into your body yeah <laughs> we have a tiny tiny guitar hit here <laughs> tiny the high frets are super easy accessible oh my god yeah <laughs> up to the 24th fret without a problem little silver dots in the side yep. let's look if they're centered <laughs> and they are because Zeal Guitars knows what the fuck they're doing um, price point on this, go! This one goes for uh, 3400 I don't know my own prices, excuse me, it's 3500 <laughs> But we have a special show deal, if you buy it now you get it for 3400 <laughs> You're making that shit up right now, right? I do, actually. <laughs> <laughs> um, here we have the same idea, but uh, with different wood combination. Um, also six, oh, and ebony pickup rings. Yep. And this is for, for this. Exactly. That's because he, it's it's the pointy. This is a big ass horn you got there. <laughs> you never hear that <laughs> from anyone. I know. Never. <laughs> never heard a joke before. It was a good uh, one. Uh, <laughs> um, also beautiful, really beautiful figured fretboard, and wooden tops on those. Are they active? Uh, no, passive. It's okay. just an ebony uh, cover on the passive pickups. Gorgeous. The big, I think that's the Hannes. Exactly. Yeah. By Schaller. Mm -hmm. For 3600. I'm not asking you anymore because you apparently don't know. I can read. So, now the big question. Is the coffee ready? Uh, soon it will be. Just give me a second. The machine is still running. <laughs> Dude, if we don't get our coffee, I'm hitting a race on that shit. I'm just letting you know. Okay. Well. <laughs> Bastian, thanks as always. Thank Check you. out Zeal Minus Guitars. Minus Guitars. Zeal Minus Guitars dot com. Um, it has been a pleasure. It's always when we as meet. As always, yeah. And um, animals at the end. Thanks, Robin, for filming.